he thought, you know what? Let's do this. She looks well fed, right? And clean? We could all use a meal and a hot shower. Wait, you find survivors? Do you find a lot? Not as many anymore, but... Well, we gotta go. Eddie might be there. Why? Look, we need people. Plain and simple. You folks can decide if you want to come as a group, or split up, or whatever. But I don't want to be out here in the open after dark. So in a few minutes, I'm going to be getting back in my car and on my way. Hopefully, at least some of you will follow me. Chell, why are we even listening to her? She's obviously lying. Even if she's not, I think it's better to just keep on the move. Staying in one place makes you an easy target. I don't care how safe you think it is. That truck stop was a death trap. It was right off the highway, for God's sake. No way you and a bunch of sick old people were gonna defend it. No, fuck this. She's crazy. I don't trust her. GG. Well, why not, Russell? I don't fucked up everything. And medicine and, and... Yeah, medicine. Look. I don't trust her, Bonnie. Then stay here if you want. I'm not bringing anyone against their will. We only want people who want to be there. I don't understand what the problem is. Are you really considering staying out here? Foraging for food like fucking raccoons? I mean, then why did we even leave the photos there? <laughs> this shit is intense! Well, it could be a trap. What if they want to kill us? Thank you. Everyone out there is batshit crazy. We've all seen it. Well, we turned out all right, didn't we? Relatively speaking. You clearly outnumber me. If you wanted to overpower me, you could. Hell, I'll even go along as your hostage until you feel safe. No one is gonna hurt you. That's not a bad idea, actually. And I'll do it. Because I know when you guys see this place, you'll change your minds. Look, I know you guys are wary. And you have every right to be. You don't know me from a hole in the ground. Yeah. And yeah, there are some crazy this girl's really good. out there. This girl All I'm here to do good is at convincing. make an offer. You can come with me, or you can stay here. The choice is yours! <laughs> I came here looking for booty. Who wants to come with me? Do I get to like select? Or Yeah. I'm going. Yeah, bitch. It's my Yeah. I have to. I'm... I'm just not sure. We've been out here for so long, and seen so much bullshit. I mean, is it really worth getting our hopes up? Of course it is, Russell. Hope is all we've got left. But being smart, that's what's keeping us alive. It's your choice. Again, I'm not trying to force you or convince you. As long as you're willing to obey the rules and pull your weight, you're welcome to come. But you've got to decide now. We're not going to be out this way again for a long time. We understand. I think we've all made up our minds. Well, I guess we have our group. What do you want to do with these? Burn them. I'm a wizard, Harry. I predicted it. Hey! This is a good thing. I know. <coughs> it. All of a sudden, <laughs> that one dude from the show. What's his name? How do we know this will work out? Oh. What's the alternative? Staying out here? Wrong thing. I don't know, man. I don't even know. No. Oh. That's it? Whose foot did you shoot off? You and 30 minutes shot Danny's foot. Yeah, I should have shot the other dude's foot. I wanted to shoot the other dude's foot, no joke. But I was like, no, I want him to be free. And then I shot his foot. Did you stay in the car or get out? You and 50% stayed in the car. I should have gotten out. Did you leave Nate or stay with him? Stayed with Nate. Did you lie to Leland? Did you leave in the RV? Or kill Stephanie? Fuck, man! Heh. <laughs>
Wait, what? Oh, okay. I was looking for that little girl. I'm like, I know there's three of them that stayed at the camp. So those three left. <laughs> those two stayed. Do I get like an after thing? Oh, okay. Maybe the goal is to try to get everyone to go. Maybe. Oh, wow. For DLC, I mean, it's like a like a 30 minute playthrough maybe, but uh, like scenario wise and decision making wise, that was quality, that was, that's top notch really. The choices, I mean the choices are, you gotta be like from a human point of view and like the time they give you, like you don't think, I didn't think ahead of this, like what am I gonna do in case this happens, I'm gonna stay with a group or I'm gonna kill off everyone. But, why does that guy have like a gun in his, a nozzle in his nose? Oh, it's a screwdriver in his eye. Oh, okay. Well, that's that. That's the DLC for The Walking Dead. Um, season 2 coming up sh uh, shortly, soon. Thanks for watching, everyone. Hope you enjoyed this DLC of The Walking Dead Episode 1. Comment, rate, subscribe. Thank you.